Hi, my name is Lisa Logan. Welcome to my So Beautiful Excel spreadsheet demo. I started collecting So Beautiful magazines over 10 years ago, and I love each and every one. I currently have every issue, which is um, 126. But whenever I wanted to make a product or, or make something in one of the magazines or uh, reference it, the more issues I collected, the harder it became. I would spend uh, the whole afternoon going through my collection of issues looking for the thing I wanted to make, and before you knew it, the afternoon was gone. So I had to come up with a solution so I could easily find the product I was looking for. And I did that by putting all the details of each issue into an Excel spreadsheet. Right now you're looking at um, the welcome page I have here on this uh, collection of spreadsheets. And you can see down here at the bottom there's several tabs in color. Uh, th this tab is the index for each So Beautiful and you can see what issue number it is and the month and what is on the cover of every issue so you can easily find the one you're looking for. And if you click on the next tab, this is the spreadsheet itself. And you can see here it starts in 1987 and uh, if you scroll way down There is, right now, fall issue number 126, 2009, and there is over uh, 1,400 lines of, of uh, information in here. So let's go back to the top, and let's see what details we can cover. So we have the year, the issue, the issue month, the cover, and smocking is a passion of mine. So we have the smocking plates that are included in each issue, and then whether or not they're a geometric, a picture, or a counter change, how many rows of smocking there are, any notes um, like bullion roses or silk ribbon I've added here. Um, what patterns come in each issue and the size. For example, in the first issue there was the California antique dress and it was size 5 through 14. And if you scroll over, there's uh, the articles, which are, most of the articles are um, the inspiration pieces that you can get a lot of ideas off of. And then you have the technical articles. For example, here it's how to make and apply corded piping and also an article on pinafore bibs. Um, you can add notes of your own. And of course, if you know Excel, you know how flexible it is. So you can change this any way you want to make, make your, or meet your specifications. And you can do that by adding uh, columns or rows or hiding them. And uh, it's very flexible and easy to use. Uh, we've got the boo-boo column that Sue used to write, and they still do a boo-boo column uh, now, later on. They call it something else. And let's see, we've got applique designs and shadow embroidery, Madeira embroidery, silk ribbon embroidery, uh, the basic floss embroidery, Duplicate stitch, like for example, there's some duplicate stitch sweaters down here in this issue. Um, doll dressing, um, paper dolls, paper dolls I started later, the kids and crafts and notes. So I tried to include everything that... Uh, so if you were looking for a particular product, it would be easy for you to find. 
So let's scroll down here a little bit. Now, one thing I did so I could find the things I was most interested in, like if I wanted to come back to it, is I would highlight the cells in color. So I could come back to this article um, or this technical article called Ballet Slippers, for example, or Romance Returns. This was about hair ornaments, or here was a, a holiday sleepwear. So these are all things I knew I wanted to come back and make. So I could color code the cell so I could easily pick them up again. And so you can see the ballet slippers are a craft and Romance Returns um, is also a craft. With, that was the hair ornament. So it's very simple to use and it has a lot of detailed information. Um, I used to do this when I'd come home from work at night and uh, it's, it was very time consuming. So I also have some bonuses down here at the bottom. I have the Fancy Work Index. You can see all six issues of Martha Pullen's Fancy Work and the Fancy Work um, uh, Project Spreadsheet. And there's some other things too. You can add anything you would like down here to keep your sewing more organized. So you can add your books and your craft books, your um, quilting material, you can add patterns. It's very easy just to put them all in a tab and then you have everything at your fingertips. So I am offering this um, spreadsheet to you as a digital download. It's easy for you to update it now with every issue of uh, So Beautiful that you'll receive in the future and any other media that you choose to add. Uh, the, the price is a reasonable $7. It's a digital download and you can um, pick this up at SewForJoy.com. That's S-E-W-F-O-R-J-O-Y.com. And my name is Lisa Logan. I want you to be happy with your purchase. Um, if for any reason you're not, please let me know. But again, check it out. It's uh, SewForJoy.com. Thank you for listening and happy sewing.